Hey, hey everyone, Greenbeard here, and welcome back to another MLB 9 Innings 22 video on my channel. Um, so we have an absolute metric ton of stuff to do today. As you can see, it's double mileage. So we will have some vintage combos to do. I also got the ultimate vintage packs. I'm not expecting anything, but I had a little bit, um, I got a little bonus uh, from my job this week. So I figured, give it a shot. We have the Ultimate All-Star Pack, Team Select Pack, Ultimate Team Select Pack, 8 Premiums, and all these other cards to go through. We have 18 Skill Change Tickets, a uh, Grade Increase Reset, a Skill Protection Change Ticket, and so on and so forth. So, we've got a lot to do today. So, they gave out this free SIG Pack to celebrate the All-Star Game, so we're going to open that. If we don't pull a team card from this, then we will do a SIG combo. So I wanted to get this done. Not a diamond, unfortunately. Gold card, twins. Nope. Chris Flexen, not a great card. Okay. So uh, it's actually nice that that's gold because we can use one of these intermediate GIs on our silver Aaron Hicks and do a three gold SIG combo. It's a small chance, but there's a chance when you do three gold SIG combo that it um, will give you a diamond back. Again, small chance, but since I only need to use one intermediate GI to make that happen, I figured why not? All right. Um, again, I could wait till double mileage, but I don't want to. So let's see what we get. Oh, man, another Yankee. Uh, okay, that's frustrating. Um, not, not a bad card, don't get me wrong. I mean, he had a weird year. That'd be a great card if it was a team card, but alas, it's not. So uh, we'll just have to wait and hope we can pull a team card in the future. Um, before we start, I did want to do, um, a little, little quick advertisement for our club here. We're looking for, you know, somebody who's maybe around 115 overall. Um, we're full now, but, you know, we, we have a spot that we can fill. Um, we finished gold three, um, but we're, we're getting pretty good. We've got a lot of good teams that are coming along. So, you know, if you're, you know, 113, 114, 115 overall, you're looking for a club and you're going to play every day, um, you know, reach out to me and I can put you in touch with the club master and we can see if it'll be a good fit. Um, all right. So now that that's out of the way, let's get started. We will do packs first. Um, Normal packs first, and then we will finish off with vintage, and then move on to everything else we have. Um, from those, from the team select diamond, obviously we're hoping for a reliever. We could really use. We really need another diamond. We actually need two more diamond team relievers. There was a um, Ryan Presley in the free agent market, but we didn't have enough free agent tickets to pull him. Um, so hopefully we can get a good reliever from the team select diamond pitcher when we go pitcher from it. Um, or, you know, hopefully we can pull something just randomly from one of these other packs. You know, uh, maybe we can get or see a diamond uh, vintage card would be great. You know, specifically a diamond team vintage. Would love to see that. Although it's not... Ooh, gold prime. Jorge Posada, and that's an awesome card. All right. Um, yeah, uh, so they they removed Roy Smalley and Rod Seavers from the game, so really it would just be Chuck Knobloch and, you know, one of the starting pitchers, Frank Viola, or um, oh, I can't remember who the other guy is. Um, so, you know, hopefully... We can see a diamond vintage. We'd love to see a diamond team vintage. But uh, not holding out a ton of hope for that specifically. 
um, we're going to have an absolute ton of premium vintage combos. So really, you know, it would be great if we could pull a legend. Specifically, um, well, actually, I would really take any kind of legend on this team. The only thing I really wouldn't particularly want to see would be... Um, oh, yeah, so this is the feature where you can open, open multiple at the same time. That's new to the game. Neither card are great, but um, it makes our lives much, much easier rather than opening each of these individually. One gold. Alrighty. Nothing super useful there. Okay. Um, we'll do these live season alts, and then we'll do the ten regular ultimate player packs. I'm really hoping we can see a couple golds. <laughs> Not golds. Screw that. Uh, a couple diamonds from the ultimate player packs. And we don't. So I jinxed us. <laughs> I jinxed us a little too hard there. Um, having terrible, terrible diamond luck of late. Alrighty. So we are actually at max. Um, we, we were perfectly at max. So uh, with bench space. So I'll go... Uh, lock up or put any guys that we need in storage, and then we'll go do some special training. All right, so first off, we've got a couple upgrades to try. See if we can get anything from these. All right, nothing there. And last one here. And nothing from either of them. That's okay. Not Neither were um, anything I was looking for specifically you know desperately okay so we should be able to with the cards that we pulled finish up fergie uh i'm currently he, he's got a slow starter set active right now because i'm just trying to level it up naturally um so let's see how far we can get okay so we definitely max him out now, can we throw you in there? Yeah. Can we... I'm trying to maximize our... Yeah. Um, you know, hold on to our best material so that we're not... And you? Dang, we need one more normal. Okay, so I'm going to just go open a normal pack. Normal or bronze pack. Just trying to keep... Um, you know, as much of the good material as we can, um, you know, so we're not wasting anything. Let's use this basic vintage pack. Unless, yeah, we just got an, well, actually, no, we're going to hold on to that in case we pull his, um, in case we pull him, you know, in a higher grade. Ooh, we just keep pulling <laughs> twins. We're just trying to pull random stuff right now. Okay, there, there's a couple. Um, so... Let's go finish up with Fergie, and once he's done, we'll ha we'll be able to start working on our batter sigs. I know. There you go. All right, so Fergie is done. We don't have to worry about his special training anymore. And now we will swap over, and I believe we want to... The goal right now is to get Mauer up to level 6, first because we are well, let's take a look at Sano here he's at almost at level eight yeah if we could get him to level eight with what we have then we would but we can't so um i'm instead going to throw this material that we have into mauer and try to get him up a little bit and we were able to get him two levels so i'm totally good with that and, you know, just make that card a little bit better. All right. So, um, I'm going to lock up this Prime so that we don't accidentally do anything to him. Lock up Erickson here. Actually, we'll throw him in the backup. Um, okay. So, before we finish doing packs and before we move on to vintages, I want to show you a couple things. Uh, Buxton's card has gotten much much worse over you know 
the the course of the the recent live update, he's just not playing very well, unfortunately, outside of hitting home runs. I'm hoping that he can turn it around. As a live card, he's still a plus to this team with this skill set that we have on him. He's still going to be a good card, but if he once he loses player of the month, unless he turns it around stat wise, he'll probably just swap over to my bench. That being said, we got a crazy train on him with 10 to the right and we haven't finished it off because we were going to wait and see how he finishes the year you know we could go seven to power and two to eye and he would end or sorry and two to contact and he would have power eye contact in that order for special training you know if he ends up with like over 80 power and his contact and eye remain low, then we could go eye contact power or something like that. So we wanted to hold off there. But again, you know, his card could end up falling off a cliff and then we don't end up doing anything with it anyway. Now, if you think that train is crazy, <laughs> here's the train we got <laughs> on our Nelson Cruz. Um, eight to the right side. And mind you, we got this train before the update to train. I I know that with the recent update with training, people have been getting a lot of really crazy trains uh, lately. This was before. This was the old train system. Um, and we were able to go power one. We've got I2 because his eye's lower and his contact's still very high. So once he's maxed out special training, like if this was our SIG card, There'd be very few batters in the game that would be better than him. So I'm super happy with that. We want to look for better skills at some point on him, but we'll see how um, the rest of this video goes and if we pull anything that we need to skill more importantly. All right, so we'll do the all-star pack and the team select packs, and then we'll hop into the vintages. So it's probably just a gold. And it's a Cody Bellinger, not a very good year, Cody Bellinger. Well, it's a fine year, I guess, but not his best year. All right, so we've got this gold team select pack. I know it's technically an alt, but it's a gold. It's always a gold. Um, Max Kepler, not a great year for him. All right, and hopefully we can pull a good reliever. A reliever we don't have. Not Tyler Duffy, please. Come on. Oh my god, another Kyle Gibson. That might even be the same year that we have. I don't know. Um, so we're just going to have to keep waiting and hoping that we can get... Um, keep hoping that we can get better. Yep, that's the exact same year we have. We just keep pulling cards that are the exact same year that we already have. That's frustrating as heck. Okay, and we'll lock you up. Okay. Alrighty, so I'm going to pause and unlock all the vintages we do have, and then we'll open the ones in our inventory, and then we'll be able to combo, and I won't need to stop in between. Alrighty, so let's get into this. We've got eight premium vintages. No diamonds. Two golds. Come on, show me a legend. All right, so no legend there. No team cards either. Three ultimates. All right, come on. Give me a diamond. There's a diamond, all right. Come on. Give me something good. Gary Carter. We pulled his um his SIG on our Phillies team. And two Tigers. All my teams, we have a tendency to pull a lot of Tigers. Alrighty, um, so let's hop right into the combos. We, because we were able to pull that diamond, we will be able to do a diamond um, vintage combo as well. Alright, legend, not Kirk Gibson, all the Tigers, my gosh. Babe Ruth. Bob Lemon. Come on. Legend, legend. No. Legend. Another Dave Rigetti. 
I mean, the golds are nice upgrades, but come on, come on. El Negro. Billy. Okay, we'll do this. Uh, come on, show me a legend. Mike Messina. Come on, legend. Ron Guidry. All right, and finally, our last combo of the day will be this diamond vintage combo. Show me a legend or a team card, please. No, nothing. Ugh, got absolutely skunked there with... We had a ton, a ton, a ton of combos. Um, and we got absolutely nothing, which is very, very frustrating. Um, but, you know, legends are rare, obviously, and that's, uh, that's just part of it. So, all right, let's hop into some of this other stuff that we have. So we have this great increase reset ticket. We're going to use him on Nelson Cruz because he's only a 61 base. And thank God he goes up <laughs> rather than going down to 60. Come on, show me something good. 71. All right, we'll take that. All right, that's a win so far. We have the skill protection change ticket. We're going to use this on Fergie. Try to get him. Oh, we locked it up. Darn it. Okay. Got to unlock that real fast. Unlock his skill set. Okay. Um, we're going to use it on slow starter. Hopefully we can pull a good second skill. And if we do, we have one skill select change ticket. Okay. Slow starter. We're going to protect slow starter. Show me a good gold, please. There's a gold. Mess. Hmm. I don't, let me know, I'm not going to use the blue right now, let me know if it's worth using a blue on that, because he's a legend, part of me wants to just keep hunting until we get a perfect skill set, so until we get something like boss, or finesse or dom, I don't mind mess as a third, with slow starter, but I don't know if it's worth using, using a blue on golden pitcher, and hoping that we get one of the better skills, let me know your thoughts um, down in the comments below. All right, so we have skill change tickets to use as well. So let me see who we want to use these on. Pitchers. What's the bar got? Finesse boss is fine. I think mostly our bullpen needs the help. Dom boss warmed up is okay. Um, Clippard has touch on its own. So let's roll a couple on Clippard here. And like I said, we want to um, we want to roll a couple on. I'll keep getting fixer on him. Um, roll a couple on Nelson Cruz as well. Winning streak, inning eater, no. We'll roll a few more, and then we'll hop over to Cruz if we don't get anything. Fixer mess. We're looking for a good setup man set on. Boss mess warmed up. We can roll with that. We can definitely roll with uh, boss mess um, warmed up. I don't know how great it will be as a setup man, but it should be better than touch on its own, I would think. All right, so we got Cruz here. All right, so we're looking for something with multiple skills rather than just, um, just spotlight on its own. Just prediction on its own? No. Come on. Almost. 
I mean, charisma reliable pinpoint strike, I think, is better than spotlight reliable. So we'll swap this one. I'm still not super happy with that. It's still like two skills. Uh, two skills right now for where this team is. No. All right. One more. Come on. MBT laser beam. Wow. Um, let's see. When do we... No, we'll, we, we'll, we'll roll these last three, actually. I'm just trying to think through. Okay. Charisma Spotlight. I can roll with that. We can roll with that for sure. Okay. Um, I believe that's all we've got today. Um, unfortunately, got terrible luck with the vintages. We got no luck with the vintages. We got no luck with the team select pack. Uh, but we were able to finish special training our Fergie Jenkins here, which meant that we were able to um, start special training Mauer, which is, you know, a good start. We've got Mess Golden Pitcher Slow Starter. At least we're at this level. That should actually be pretty good, I would think. Um, I just don't know whether or not that's worth rolling a, a blue on Golden Pitcher and keeping Mess or rolling some more greens until we get a better second skill. Um, we use the GI Reset on Nelson Cruz. Got him up to 71, which is you know, a huge boost based on his GI distribution. So, you know, he got a lot better. I think he got like a couple to contact, one to eye, and then a like four to power or something crazy like that. Um, so, and with his new skill set, Spotlight Charisma, he should continue to rake for me. So, um, you know, this team is coming along. I'm really happy with the progress that we continue to make. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.